Waffles, and here they do have the sausage and a slice of bacon. Yeah. Bradley got the same thing, and Kristen just got a side of bacon. <laughs> yeah, like open it up. And that was four dollars. I can open it. I opened it. One, like two and a half pieces. So I could have gotten a kid's meal. Yeah. What are you doing, woman? I didn't want it. So, um, it's our first breakfast at the Contemporary, and just to talk about the Yacht Club versus the Contemporary. Food Court is a billion times better as a Contemporary because it is so much bigger and it's like people come here. It's close to a uh, food court you'd get at any of the other resorts. The Deluxes don't really have food courts. At Yacht Club it was in the store and there was like three grabbing, like it was not good. Even breakfast, like breakfast they were making fresh. I saw the little waffle makers but like the waffles weren't good. So they just must make them in batches and depending on how often people are getting it. Uh, and then for like lunch and dinner, there's not many options to pick from. So the only thing I ate was a salad and it was just a pre-made Caesar salad for 12 bucks. And like the salad I got at Terralino was a thousand times better. So food court wise, contemporary is it. And I just like had an option of the food court. And they had peanut butter here. They did not have peanut butter at breakfast at the Yacht Club, but they have it at like Pops, so I don't know how they pick who gets it and who doesn't. And yeah, those are the, that was like the biggest difference between the two, between the two theme parks so far. So we have made it into the Magic Kingdom. Uh, it is definitely the most crowded day that we have had. The wait times are all pretty up there. So they do say that Mondays is not the day to go to Magic. They say that's where everyone goes. Um, and it seems true right now. It's very crowded. But we are with our friends, so I'm not filming much today. Just maybe filming like parts of the ride and we'll like update when I'm not standing with them. So won't see too much of me. I am Skipper Katie. I will be your skipper. I will be your guide. Your Jedi Master. And uh, this was awkward. For those on board, by the way, we don't laugh today. Surprise! I will be your swim instructor. <laughs> We have finally made it over to Wilderness after saying for a few years now we wanted guys to point. We have made it. So nice.
Chris, I got the margarita flight. All I remember is black cherry. Spicy pineapple. Oh no. Um, cucumber. Raspberry. Yeah. Raspberry. And cucumber melon. It's fancy. Mm -hmm. I like it. $22. I think that's pretty good. Yeah. Kristen and I are splitting the cheesy brisket. It comes with chips. Ooh. And then the sticky wings. And then we got a burger waiting on that. And we're the the kids. And then we got the bison burger. But I don't like cheese, so we did not get it with cheese. Sorry, Kristen. But that looks delicious. And he did split it with us for us. We said we were splitting it. And the menu doesn't say french fries, but it did come with french fries. And they do pipe in happily ever after the fireworks music here. Oh. In that beautiful lobby. You like it here? Fancy. Hello. Over there. All right, we're leaving Wilderness. Waiting for the boat. And here it is. We're gonna go to the market. Thank you, and then go get a good tent. And we got the front row, aka it's only us and one other family. <laughs> Woo! How was dinner? Good. You liked your burger? Yeah. yeah. And we had uh, the fireworks. Yeah, and you even played music. Yeah, that was nice. Yeah, we could listen to music. I know. Did you see it fully or was it cut off? No, you saw it, you saw it nice on the water. Oh. You saw fully, like all the fireworks. Because well, yeah. from the contemporary pool, you only see like half. Fireworks. Yeah, but like that the contemporary don't have music playing yeah, or the beach or the beach and yacht club Like we were on the beach and no music. Yeah, lame on, yeah. All you gotta do is pipe it in lame And just like that, another day has come to an end. Uh, we were in the middle of talking about dinner, but then people joined us on the boat. So, dinner we had, me and Kristen split the burger, the brisket, cheesy dip, and the wings. I really liked the cheesy brisket with chips. Um, it tasted like chili. It did not taste like, like chili. chili. Yeah, it it did, did not. It did not like it. And I eat canned chili a lot, and it did not taste like that. The burger I, I liked, I probably, I didn't love the jam on it. I like I the aioli more, so I'd rather just more aioli. Man. Uh, but it was like a decent burger. Like it wasn't anything special. I thought the burger in Connections Cafe was better. What the? What? I can't say because I did not eat that burger. But I like the burger at Steakhouse better. Mm -hmm. And then the wings I did not like. They were very. They were, I, tasted salty. More and soy I, than teriyaki. And I love, love, love salt, but it was like a weird flavor. I couldn't. I, I had one and I let Kristen eat the rest. Yeah, my, I'm very thirsty. Yeah, it was not. And I, I did not like that. But the ambiance was nice. I really liked it there. It was very relaxing. And they played the fireworks. I thought that was nice. Uh, and yeah, so that's how we ended our night. Then we took the boat back, and it was a very nice boat ride back. It was a very nice boat. Yeah, it was I, very pretty coming up to Magic, Magic yeah. Kingdom with all their lights on and stuff. Yeah, so I did like that. And we ended. We went back into the contemporary uh, store, and I got the sweatshirt that I've wanted in February that they didn't have. The 2023 sweatshirt. Ew. And I am glad that 
Um, I was going to order it on Shop Disney, and I do like things um, bigger. So I was going to order a very big size, and I dropped down two sizes, and it's still pretty big. I wish I could go down another size, but I checked all the stores, and they don't have it. So I took it because I really wanted it. Um, but I'll keep the receipt to see if I could find it somewhere else, but... I'll probably just stick with this. So glad I did try it on because it is very oversized. And probably got a Mickey, 2023 Mickey. And yeah, it was a good day. Uh, oh, I didn't talk about because we were with friends, so I didn't really film today. But I did do Tron with our friends. And I was a little nervous to go on it because I did get nauseous the last time, which resulted to being nauseous on the bus ride home, which was not fun. Uh, so me and my friend did the regular seating on it and I was able to it, I still got a slightly nauseous but like just while riding it like once it stopped I was fine but I also get a little nauseous on Seven Dwarfs, uh, Big Thunder, Slinky like I just get a little nauseous on all those rides so it wasn't anything that like stuck with me and it was so much more comfortable I don't know if I didn't sit in it correctly the bike but I literally was bent in half and like seeing other people go on today I've Everyone was doing it. By the time we got to the end, and we were stuck at the end again, not for long, for like two minutes, but you saw everyone like trying to push up to uh, stand straight because it's so uncomfortable. So I don't know if there's a different way, like if I sat incorrectly, because uh, someone else that we were with was able to stand a little straighter in the seat. So I would have to probably do the test seats to see if I could fix that. And yeah, don't really know what the plan is for tomorrow yet, so we'll see and see where the day takes us. And with that, and with that I, I say, good night, everyone! Yeah, come over here. <laughs> say it. Bradley, I. Bradley, out. Okay, can you just cut out that part? Cut out it. Cut it, 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 cut it. Ha ha ha!